Hello, welcome back. I'm gonna read this story called Unicorn Magic. Periwinkle lived in the forever forest with her unicorn friends. Every unicorn in the land was born with a magical power. One day, Periwinkle sat on the ground with her friend. Birdie, I'm feeling sad, she said. I don't think I could do anything special. I wish I knew my power, sighed Periwinkle to her friend. Cheer up, cheer up, tweeted Birdie. You just need to believe in magic and follow your heart. Early next morning, Periwinkle galloped around Inspiration Grove, where she found Ruby beginning to create the sunrise. I can't decide how to finish painting the sky, said Ruby. Birdie told me to believe in magic and follow my heart, said Periwinkle. Maybe it will work for you. Ruby thought for a moment and then took a deep breath and she painted a beautiful sky. I love it, said Periwinkle, wishing she could discover her own magical power. Periwinkle and Birdie found Pearl nearby on the shore of Reflection Lake. A few puffy clouds hung in the sky overhead. I'm not sure my cloud spinning power is very magical today, said Pearl, sounding a little troubled. Birdie fluttered her wings. Periwinkle smiled and said, believe in magic and follow your heart. Pearl closed her eyes and animal clouds bellowed and frolicked across the sky. I did it, exclaimed Pearl. Thank you, thank you. Entering Mellow Meadow, Periwinkle and Birdie saw their friend Marigold. I can't decide where to plant the pretty orange and pink flowers, sighed Marigold. Don't think about it and just follow your heart, Periwinkle suggested, as her horn gave off small colorful sparks. Marigold closed her eyes and the center of the meadow filled with sweet smelling orange and pink flowers that grew and bloomed. Lovely, exclaimed Marigold. Periwinkle stopped for a moment. Birdie, she sniffled, shedding a few tears. What if I don't have any magic in my horn? Nonsense, chirped Birdie. You are the most magical unicorn I know. But Birdie, said Periwinkle, Ruby can paint the sky. Pearl can spin animal clouds, and Marigold grows sweet-smelling flowers. I can't do anything magical. Just then, Pearl, Ruby, and Marigold appeared. We wanted to thank you for being such a great friend, they chimed. Periwinkle smiled and joined her friends. She whispered to them, I wish I knew my magical powers. They all cheered. Believe in magic and follow your heart. Periwinkle closed her eyes. Her unicorn horn glowed with magic. A beautiful rainbow arched all the way across the forest. My magic, exclaimed Periwinkle. We just needed to believe in ourselves, they cheered. That's the very best magic of all. The end. Thank you.